slowly claiming his new home, Jamie pulls his car into the garage for the first time and gets to work on settling in. The next morning, he goes to consolidate the supplies from the other two houses. With the neighborhood fully secure, Jamie settles into the welcome calm for now, but knows that there are still items he'll need if he wants to make this home sustainable. Letting that worry linger for now, he cooks himself another meal and puts up the preparations that had saved his life previously. Ending the evening by skimming through a book on carpentry, he eventually heads to bed late into the night. Thankful for each home-cooked meal now, Jamie knows it's time to leave the safety of his home once more, aiming to explore the nearby roads in search of more supplies. Tired and faced with too many undead to keep going, Jamie manages very little on his first outing before heading home for the night. Thank you.
Wanting to feel some sort of accomplishment, he takes inspiration from the nearby dock and attempts to spearfish for the first time. Though it takes several hours, he catches one of the smallest slimy creatures and suffers through filleting it for that evening's meal. Feeling more disgusted after handling the fish than he had during his encounters with the undead, he takes the time to wash himself before turning in. Noticing his beard had grown unkempt, Jamie disregards the small annoyance as he establishes the goal of finding more carpentry knowledge today. Having poured through the only volume he had, he hopes to find another book that can aid him in securing his new home. Happening upon an ominous horde, Jamie feels his heart stop for a moment before his smoldering vengeance provides him with resolve. Managing to loot the building they had been gathered around, Jamie first gets a glimmer of hope by finding a sack of potatoes before realizing the rest of the warehouse is entirely rotten. Able to acquire a mostly empty fuel barrel on his way out, Jamie still hunts for the woodworking knowledge that he needs. Hitting a main road in the afternoon and preparing to go back home, he spots an abandoned bug on the road and decides to investigate. In one of the few lucky breaks this world now offers, he nearly cries at discovering the very book he needed in the beetle's trunk. Arriving home in a glorious mood, he braves fishing once more before turning the potatoes he had found into a hearty soup. Eventually changing out some of his tattered clothes, he tucks himself into the comfy chair in his living room and only manages a few pages of his book before heading to bed. Waking up with true hope in his heart, Jamie fishes in the early light of the dawn before catching the biggest fish he had ever seen. Fully fed, keeping up with his fitness, and truly happy, he dedicates the majority of the day to his new manual, but finds more time to fish and watch an old VHS on the TV.
a day of hard work, Jamie cherishes the brief moment that he's able to forget the horrible state of the world, laying his head down for bed with a smile and peaceful dreams. Thank you.